we're diving into the world of baby boomers and their unstoppable winning streak. Yes, the boomers are at it again, and this time they're not just reminiscing about Woodstock and bell bottom jeans. They're making a big impact on finance, and we're here to explore why. Stay tuned to the end as we check in with our resident stock market oracle Simon to see how you can get in on the action. So today, we're talking about the baby boomers, and no, it's not about a sudden resurgence in diaper sales. What do they have that we don't? Well, a whole bunch of stuff. These lovely folks born between 1946 and 1964 have got wealth, they've got homes, and they've got a sense of nostalgia that makes us all a bit jealous. They've either paid off their homes or locked in their mortgages at rock bottom rates. It's like they've got some sort of financial fairy godmother sprinkling magic all over them. But what does all this mean for us, the younger generations? Well, the boomers are spending money like it's going out of style. And who can blame them? With high interest rates knocking on our doors, they're not the ones feeling the pinch like we are. They're out there spending like there's no tomorrow. And that's great news for some savvy investors. Now here's where the real fun begins. Bank of America have shared a little secret with us. They've outlined the areas that are gonna ride the wave of the boomer spending spree. And it's like a treasure map of investment opportunities. We're talking about sectors like healthcare, entertainment and home improvement. These are the places where you could potentially strike gold. It's like the boomers are throwing a financial party and we're all invited. You can invest in these sectors and enjoy the ride along with the boomers. But hey, maybe you're not too keen on investing in these sectors. That's okay, you can invest like the boomers do. What's their secret recipe? Well, it's a dish served on a silver platter. Treasuries, usually a retiree's favourite, are offering yields that are looking pretty darn attractive to the rest of us right now, hovering near 5%. With all the stock market ups and downs, these nearly risk-free investments are starting to look pretty tasty. I mean, the stock market's become a wild ride with all its ups and downs. It's like trying to surf the tsunami on a tea tray. So maybe a little stability isn't such a bad thing. Now before you start counting your boomers before they've hatched, there's a little myth we need to bust. You might have heard about the great wealth transfer, where the younger generations inherit a boatload of cash from the boomers. Well sorry to burst your bubble, but that's mostly a myth. The reality is, only the wealthiest families can expect to see life-changing money passed down. For the rest of us, well you'll often hear boomers saying things like, my kids can have whatever's left over but I'm not living my life to try and save money for them. And you know what? I say live your life and enjoy it while you can. In a moment, we'll check in with Simon the Predictive Tortoise to see how you can get in on the action. But just quickly, if you're keen to follow the boomer's footsteps into the glamorous world of investing, Robin Hood's your best buddy. They've made it so easy, it's like the financial equivalent of a microwave dinner. Pop it in, press a few buttons and boom! You're in the investing game. And the best part, it's commission free. No sneaky costs hiding in the shadows. Whether you're into stocks, ETFs, or even those wild and woolly cryptocurrencies, Robin Hood's got your back. And they even throw in some educational goodies to make sure you're not just blindly throwing darts at the stock board. So sign up for Robin Hood and make those dreams of financial glory come true. All while sipping coffee in your pyjamas. Links in the notes below. No doubt about it, the boomers are on a roll. And you can either invest in the sectors they're boosting or invest like them with those trusty treasuries. Simon, where should we be investing to ride the wave of the boomer boon?